Meantime, Boeing is uh, trying for a third time to launch its Starliner spacecraft. This one would be historic with humans on board. Our Morgan Brennan is here to break down the action as it happens. Morning, Morgan. Good morning. That's right. Well, you can see right there on your screen, we've got the countdown. We're about a minute, uh, give or take, away from what could be a historic moment here for Boeing, for NASA, for human spaceflight, as this would represent the sixth, only the sixth inaugural crewed spacecraft flight uh, with Boeing for the first time ever with Starliner, 10 years in the making, uh, two astronauts, national astronauts on board, on board, poised to send them to the International Space Station. Butch Wilmore, Sonny Williams. Uh, this is basically the third time we've seen this attempt to launch in the last month with those astronauts on board. Uh, and it's poised to happen here any second, it looks like. Uh, maybe one minute away. Uh, I'm not sure if my camera is a little off here. Um, but uh, guys, this would add a second commercial spacecraft to the roster for NASA alongside uh, SpaceX's Dragon capsule, which has been carrying astronauts to the international. There we go. It's launching. Commander Butch Wilmer there calling down to Mission Control here in Houston that the spacecraft has begun rolling into the right attitude for its ascent. And the guidance, navigation, and control officer here in the room seeing good data on that. Starboard passing through Max Q. The uh, point of maximum dynamic, dynamic pressure where the forces of air friction are highest, which in Sunny will shortly be passing through Mach 1, where the speed of sound 